grateful to be here. I'm grateful for the God of heaven who allowed me to meet a man, Gary Plant, who's crazy enough to build the wall of China and uh, uh, move a half acre 20 feet high. And he is a good man. And I know he's, he is wealth, and you, you've got to have wealth to do this, but he uses his money to help people, for which I am grateful. I am grateful for all those who are behind me in my organization, my sons, my daughter who's a nurse, my good wife who's a wonderful decorator. Don't you guys love it? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. My daughter uh, created these things and it, it very much is uh, part of what uh, Bernalillo is. Um, I'm grateful, I truly am grateful for the opportunity to care for the elderly. Um, it's a great opportunity and service for us that we learn about their lives, what they did, and their hopes and their dreams. And the goal at Beehive is to help them believe there's still a dream to have. And that patio must have cost a half a million dollars, I want you to know. <laughs> but it's a dream, a dream saver out there. To look at that mountain and dream of wind and what was when they were they were young people and it created it gives them self-worth and self-esteem to continue on we have some dignitaries here today and, and uh, mr plant we'd like to him to recognize that recognize them. gary uh, thank you everybody for coming today uh, for the opening of uh, this beehive this is the, the newest one and uh, this is just one in the chain of the group of homes that are uh, owned and operated by Jay Manning and Beehive Homes. So we're really pleased to, to have you here. Um, there's just a number of people that, that we could thank for this project happening. And we, we're not going to be able to thank everybody, but we do have a few uh, dignitaries here, elected officials that did help uh, make this project possible and we'd like to recognize them. Uh, first, I'd like to recognize the mayor of the town of Bernalillo, uh, Mayor Torres. Thank you, Gary. Um, as, as mayor, I get to do some not fun things and then sometimes I get to do some extremely wonderful things and, and I want to thank Gary, Jay, and everyone involved for doing this project for our community and for allowing me to be here because it's such a wonderful addition to our community. Uh, Bernalillo's a beautiful place to live. Uh, there's 8,320 of us who call it home according to the census. Um, we're here because we want to be here. Um, I grew up in Bernalillo, went away for a few years, thought I could find something better and realized what a jewel this community was and still is. And so I welcome Jay and Beehive to our community. You're a wonderful addition. We're happy that you're here. Uh, the facility is beautiful. Um, I'm sure what you'll be doing for residents here real soon will be positive, good, and wonderful. And again, uh, thank Gary for his vision. Uh, we're going to have to change your, your phrasing from the Great Wall of China to the Great Wall of Bernalillo. There you go. <laughs> but uh, again, so many people drive 550 and Often I heard, especially early on, what's going on over there? What's going to happen? Real curiosity. And as this project has come together and got some publicity and people realized what was here, what I heard over and over is what a nice, nice addition to the community. So again, uh, to you all, thank you. Uh, to staff that will be here, welcome to our community. Uh, the town offices are open to you, open to your residents. If there's anything we can do, our numbers are on our website. We're easy to get a hold of, and we will respond to you. So again, thank you for being here, and, and welcome to Bernalillo. Well, first of all, we'll start by thanking uh, Gary. Thank you for all your hard work and putting something like this together. Uh, this is, is this home or what? This is a homey place. This is really nice, uh, amazing, uh, just well, well put. Uh, I want to thank also that it, you know, it brings everything to, to our, our small town here in Bernalillo and to our, into our county for our rural communities. It opens the door for everyone. So it, it helps out San Jose County tremendously on every aspect you can think of because there are people in all our, all our county 
that I know that can use a facility like this. And I want to thank you, Dean Gary. Thank you for inviting me. Thank you for being, me being part of San Juan County and being supportive. Thank you, Gary. I'm going to try to win this without the microphone. Everybody hear me okay? I tend to speak with my hands, so the microphone goes all over the place. Uh, I'm John Sapien. I have the honor of, of representing uh, Bernal Leo in the state senate. Uh, when Commissioner Leonard uh, asked me to meet with Mr. Plans about this project, uh, they, they had me at hello. Uh, I will tell you, being familiar with the Beehive uh, model, uh, it hits close to home. Uh, for those of you who know my parents, uh, you also know that my mom cared for my grandmother for 13 years uh, in our home. She was blind and had Parkinson's disease. During that same 13 years, my grandfather, who was 90, uh, lived with us for four years until his passing. Uh, a model like this didn't exist back then. And this goes back 20 some odd years. Uh, so uh, by happy chance, my wife happened to actually work for another uh, company that does this type of, not this type of model, a little bit different, but is still in the long-term care arena. And so to allow, I really to, to create a, a model where people can come and live their lives in comfort and really care for people. I take my hat off to the Mannings. Uh, I appreciate what Mr. Manning said about the ability to care for people. Uh, you know, that's really where my uh, really affection for what is being done here on this site and for the, the foresight by Mr. Plant and, and really the, the love of caring for people by the Mannings. That's where they had me at Hello. Uh, this is a great addition to Bernalillo, Bernalillo area. Uh, it is right at that uh, level where the residents around Bernalillo are really going to take advantage of this. Uh, I know that Mr. Plant wanted me to talk a little bit about this adding to the economic development of the area. Absolutely. But it really in my heart, uh, to echo Mr. Manning, the, the opportunity to take care uh, of uh, this constituency is phenomenal. And so I take my hand off to everybody involved in the facility, uh, from the, those ladies cook, uh, cutting, the, cutting the fruit to, uh, to everybody else that's going to be involved in this project. Thank you. Thank you for coming to Bernalillo, Mr. Plant, and thank you very much. Uh, not many words, but uh, I appreciate, uh, appreciate all the kind words from you, Mr. Plant, but uh, ultimately the uh, hard work was done by our project manager, Scott McCollum, and our superintendent, Diago Romero, who's, who's here every day, five, six days a week, uh, eight to ten hours a day, and all the, uh, all, all the hard work that he put in is, is evident while you're standing with him today. So, thank you. Um, we'd like to say thank you to Donnie Leonard for coming today. Donnie's been a very close friend and uh, and worked with us and, and helping us work through the process of getting this project done. We also want to thank Janet Cunningham and her staff uh, with the town of Leo who have just been excellent to work with uh, in getting this project done. So I know there's a lot of people that we haven't thanked. Uh, the ones that I missed, uh, uh, please forgive me. I want to turn this back to Jay. And Thank you again for coming. So all of you are here now, and we want you to be raving fans. You know what it is to be a raving fan? You go out and you tell people, I saw the bee and I have the best thing I've seen. You ought to go see what it looks like. We need to fill this home, and we are counting on you to help us in this process. Um, so don't go up, don't leave here hungry. We, we don't want to take any of this back. And I used to have nine kids. I'm down, I'm down to two, so I don't have the mouths to feed anymore. <laughs> so please eat well and uh, go right ahead. Thank you. <laughs>